Zidane, Beck, Ben Bartman. So the winner of this will go through to the semi-finals to meet Evgeny Zhorov of Russia, who we've just seen win his quarter-final against Ali Round Shamanov. Entry of Mongolia in the red. Southpaw Moreno of, of Spain in the blue, shaping up in the orthodox stance, and Engzrit immediately looks to try and throw left hand down the middle, and the referee straight away getting in there and, and talking about the clashing of the front feet. They, they do do that, the, the referees. And I understand it's something that fighters want to try and avoid, but there's just not really anything they can do about it. When you step in to try and punch, you're not looking where your opponent's foot is. Right to the body there from Moreno, came in from a long way out. It looks full of intent. Gloves carried low. For the most part, just pulls them up there. Just feeling with that jab, looking to try and line up the left hand if he can. Matsui Moreno comes in from quite a long way out to attempt the right hand, but he's just being manoeuvred back into the corner there. And Zurich, bit by bit by bit, with that front foot pressure. We'll get to a point where he will then pull the trigger. <laughs> Stiff left hand straight down the pipe there from Engzerich. It was kind of half blocked by Reno. He's kind of dictating terms with his with his feet here, Engzerich. As I said, just. Just inching in, inching in, front foot pressure. Moreno will always feel like Enzerich's right on top of him. Even if he's not really throwing, because he looks like he's going to, there's that kind of imminent threat from him all the time. And that's how he's just manoeuvring him from corner to corner to corner, really. But you've got to make sure you throw scoring punches as well, right to the body there from... Fantoy Moreno, and there's been a fair amount of, as I say, posturing, effective posturing from Engzerich in this opening round. A good straight left hand there a few seconds ago as well. He could maybe have just let his hands go slightly more than he has, left to the body from Engzerich. Second left hand there got through. And he's just looking to fight his way out of the corner there. Good left hand on the inside there from Engzerich. Antoine Moreno, though, liked that first round by the look of it. He did definitely get some work done. Engzerich looked like the boss. I've used that phrase before. He definitely did because he's got that front foot pressure and he's got that latent imminent threat about him, but he didn't actually throw as much as he might have done. It's enough to win him the round, though with four judges, ten nines there. Moreno with one in his favour. They can out, please.
round two. So it's the second round, Lengsrich or Mongolia in the red. Moreno, Spain in the blue. Good jab there from Enzerik. Right hand to the body there from Moreno. Just trying to throw long off the ropes there. Left to the body from Engdrick, but then got caught by a, a jab there from Moreno. Again, he steps in, looking to throw that long, long sweeping right hand. It's just really interesting to watch how Enzerich just manages to push Monreno around the ring, back into corners or onto the ropes without really doing anything. As I said there, it's just that front foot pressure. He looks like he's about to throw at any second and he's right on the borderline of range. And Moreno will get pushed back into a position he doesn't really want to be in. He'll realise that he doesn't really want to be there and he'll generally step out like he did there, throwing long punches to try and just fight his way out the vape out of a corner. I do think the Mongolian could maybe throw a bit more. He's very sparing with what he does throw. Left hand from Engzerich. Did get through, I think. It's just the odd jab, the odd backhand. Left hand to the body there. Pretty much. At least 50%, I would say, of what he does throw is... He's landing, that's, that's a very, very high percentage. That's just a guess off, off the top of my head from, from what I'm watching here. That's what it seems like anyway, because as I say, he is, he is quite sparing. Right hand there from Moreno. But again, he's just manoeuvring him back to the corner there. Left to the body. Four-one in favour of Engzerich again there, so that means we've got him ahead by two points on three of the cards and the other two levels. So that's a commanding lead. It's going to take a titanic final round here from Moreno to turn that around. If he does get through here, Rangsarek, it'll be interesting to see that fight against Zorov because he's going to have to throw more against Second Zorov. Half, he's going to have to. Because Zorov will take that right hand whenever he feels like it's half on offer. Third round. So, third and final round. Stukban Enzerich of Mongolia is, is in control of this. Two points up on, on three cards against Juan Pantoy Moreno of Spain in the blue. Good left hand there from Enzerich. He just completely controlled the distance here, Engzerich, and if you control the distance, you control the fight. Boxing is all about distance, really. Jab there from Engzerich and sent the left hand through. Moreno trying to lead off with his left. Because the distance the fight is at, that will determine what kind of fight it is, and if you decide 
what kind of fight it is. Then you're in business because you're going to choose one that suits you. Right hand to the body there from Moreno. One that plays to your strength, of course. there from Engzerich counting down towards the final round little uppercut and then pivoted around the front foot just looking to put his punches together a little bit more there maybe we'll see some flourishes from him in this final minute it's an economical style too he doesn't really waste anything in terms of unnecessary movement he chooses to say as I've said on the borderline of range we work around his opponent for the most part will take his feet back out when he feels he needs to just leaning in with a head there just offering the head to Moreno seeing if he'll go for it Good counter left hand there from Enzerich as, as Moreno came forward. It's been good to watch this, I've enjoyed it. It's Technically, this has been a very good display from Enzerich. It might not have been the most explosive, but the way he's just manoeuvred his opponent around the ring and made him do really exactly what he wanted him to do and then just picked him off with those single shots, the old combination. Is impressive. Ladies and gentlemen, in the bow, number number three hundred. 28 in the ring, we win five points with unanimous decision from the Red Corner. Subbat Enzor Git, Mongolia. Three goes. The Mongolian into the semi finals, where I'll face Evgeny Zhirov. And he's got it by unanimous decision, so he's taken that final round with all five of the judges there. And we will be seeing him again. He's got a bronze medal.